I've been seeing a lot on YouTube recently, people who will like take apart their entire computer and they'll clean it all out and everything. And it always pisses me off when they don't clean the power supply. They're always like, oh no, the capacitors will kill me and the power supply, oh my god, I'm gonna die. And it's so annoying. So today, I'm gonna show you how to safely clean your power supply. It's super easy and like, I just can't believe people never do it on YouTube. Like, it's so, it's so easy. You just remove the screws and use... Here, I'll show you. So, first you want to turn your computer off. Well, it's going to turn off. Maybe you just want to do this. Flip the switch. Alright, you want to turn it off. And then you'll see there's a light here. And it's still on. And once that light drains off, that means the capacitors are discharged. See? The capacitors should be discharged now because that light went out. But you're gonna just going to want to unplug all the cables that go into the PC. Like this. Unplug the power. And you're going to want to take your power supply and open it up. Right, you'll now see I have the power supply open. It's very easy. You just remove the screws and it should open up nice and easy. That just slides right off. And you'll see there's a circuit board and the power supply. And you'll see right here are two capacitors. They're 200 volt capacitors. You want to make sure these are discharged because obviously if you touch them you'll get a really big shock. And this is what people are scared of. They're always thinking these are going to like kill them and stuff. Eh, I doubt it. I doubt this would kill you, but it would sure hurt. Um, none of these other capacitors are, you don't have to worry about them. They're all low voltage. You only have to worry about these two big ones. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. What you want to do is flip the power supply over like this. Easy. And you want to take one of these things. It's a multimeter, and if you don't have one, go get one, because you need one. And then what you want to do is you want to go to the 200 volts DC scale. I'll just put that right there. And then you want to look at the capacitor for the polarity. So the negative is on this side. And then simply probe the capacitor. And you'll see there's... 0.9 volts. So this these capacitors are discharged. See? Discharged capacitors. Safe to touch. See? I'm not dying right now. It's safe to touch. So, there you go. There's nothing to be scared of in a computer power supply. And what you want to do then is you just want to take a brush or something. Brush it all out. Or you could take some spray. And blow it all out. And you're done. It's that easy. So everyone should do this. And not be scared of uh, killing themselves on capacitors. Because that's just really stupid. Like it's so easy. Anyone can do this. You just have to like not be a complete idiot. You can just use a multimeter. To make sure they're discharged, it's so easy. Oh, you all want to see that it's still working, and yeah, I am gonna prove that. So let's get it in. If I can do this one-handed, here we go. Wait a minute. The monitor wasn't plugged in properly. There you go. Still working. And it, don't, it took me less than five minutes to take it apart and clean it. 
Like, seriously.